I'm Mike Wilson. I am president of Oodlewild Citizens for Responsible Growth. This is a hard topic for me to touch on, uh, but it has reached this in our fight of the R3 zoning request that Dr. Ballard has been requesting. 2003, we had a, a relative easy fight. Uh, we handled this with two, two meetings through the, the county zoning and the county committee. But this time, it has been a lot different. We have been through zoning twice. We have been through annexation twice. And we're fixing to approach the city council. It will probably be two visits also at the minimum. We have reached the point that we feel like that we need legal representation for ourselves to have a better case to present before the city council. In these terms, we have already entered. His name is John Anderson. He comes across with all his background as a great, respectful attorney. He is very experienced, experienced in the zoning issues of what we are facing. Of course, everyone knows, including myself, that a attorney is not cheap. So we are asking for donations. You can go online, voiceforudwild.org. There is three ways that we can approach this. You can actually mail a check to our treasurer, Clay Smith. The address and all the directions that you would need by sending him a check is listed on the website. Uh, you can pay also by PayPal. The last alternative, if anyone is unfamiliar with any of these two options or has any problem understanding it, you can drop me a check off and I will personally assure you that it is going to our campaign. The check should be addressed, voice for Udawai, and your amount of donation. Uh, this is a hard time to be asking for donations of any kind, but this is a serious matter. This 230-unit apartment complex should not only affect the people in the Hunter Road area, but this could be a starting point for the entire city of Udawai. Uh, we could have apartment complexes pop up everywhere. We're in a R1, A1 community where families raise their kids with yards and no fear of, with, without any fear of an apartment, apartment complex looming on their horizon. This particular unit is proposed on 13 acres, 230 units. That it will be a lot of children, a lot of people, and a lot of kids. This unit will be developed more or less as three-story buildings. All you will see will be the buildings, asphalt, and concrete. It is not good for anyone in the area as far as the safety aspect, for adults, children, vehicles, anything concerning Hunter Road. So I ask each and every one of you, if there's any way possible, please help us in our fight. Thank you.